you come from um, a town called Grand Grantham or Grand Grantham, Grantham, yeah. Grantham, which is also the town of Isaac Newton and Margaret uh -huh. Thatcher. Isaac is Newton went to school there. He was born in, I think he was born in Stamford or something. I don't know. All right. Yes, right, you're right. You're right. Yes. Mm -hmm. Is it uh, something of importance for you or? Grantham? Yeah. <laughs> no. Not really. I mean, it's all right. It's your hometown. <clears throat> and uh, lots of memories there. Mm -hmm. uh, that's about it. Yeah. You know. And the town was elected uh, twice, I think, the most boring town in the UK. I don't know. Uh, in the, in the so 80s. That's a fine line. Are you right it's a fine line, that, really. <laughs> I think. Uh, oh, yeah. Most places. Thank you. Ooh. <laughs> Correct. Most, ooh. You could, couldn't you? Sometimes. No, I'm fine. I'm alright. <laughs> uh, yeah. Uh, Just. It's a fine line, you know. England, in fact, anywhere in the world, depends what state of frame of mind you're in. Really, mm -hmm. is it can be boring. <laughs> they forgot to mention that. Cap <laughs> Capitalist, capitalist, capitalist machine is, <laughs> is, is probably the most banal, boring thing ever. Well, that's so, it. Uh, that's you it. know, it's like, more than the towns. More than the towns. Yeah. <laughs> so Nottingham is your uh, home port at the moment, I think. Um, do you think you will uh, live there uh, <coughs> during your uh, whole life, or? If you could you imagine to uh, live uh, in another part of the world or yeah, in the yeah. UK or where? Yeah. Um, well, Andrew lives in Lincoln, just well in the uh, near, near his, well. Yeah, pretty much home. Lincoln. Yeah, so maybe even more sort of mm -hmm. out in the sticks kind of thing. Um, but um, yeah, I'm in Nottingham. Yeah, I'd probably stay there. Yeah. yeah. But it's yeah, but it's Brexit. You know what I mean? I would have moved. I, I could move to Belgium or somewhere, but. Brexit. I don't it's, know what's happening. Yeah. You know, it's difficult now. I don't want to buy somewhere, uh, in a, buy a house in another country that I can't live in. Yeah. You know, or some shit. Yeah, <laughs> sure. You know. Sure. Um, what was your um, first motivation to uh, begin in music, to play gigs? And when did it uh, appear for you? In the childhood uh, or when you were. famous, really. You know, to be a rock and roller. I wanted to be uh, famous. Yeah. And rich. <laughs> to become rich. Yeah. What What does money mean for you? What, what What's your um? It's just being from the eighties, isn't it? Really, though. You know, we were completely like propagandized with all that kind of thing, didn't we? Yeah. You know, everything from Rick Astley to. Yeah. You know. <laughs> Yeah, it's all about achieving your dreams, wasn't it? Mm. Breakfast club, mm. uh, you know. <laughs> <laughs> money, money is nice to have it, you know. Yeah. We're not by no means it's rich, money, but you know, it's just nice to. We never, we never had a lot as individuals before, to be honest. You know, we mm -hmm. had jobs or, you know, weren't <coughs> claiming benefits and uh, getting by on. Not not a lot, mm -hmm. but, um, but yeah, it's nice to have money to pay the pay the rent, mortgage, and not have to worry about food, and to be able to buy clothes. And yeah, yeah, it's great. All right. Um, there there is still a lot of anger, I think, in your songs. Where does it come from? This anger. Oh God. Anything. Yeah. From the bathroom yeah. this morning. Yeah. <laughs> From breakfast yesterday. <laughs> yeah. Fucking airports. <laughs> but so sometimes maybe you, you could like to, to say, okay, let it go, fuck. I, 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 I would want a more uh, peaceful life. Um, well, we have, have got children. Peaceful, yeah, yeah, we have you, got peaceful lives, mm -hmm. you know, really. We are peaceful people in a lot of respects. We're, we're about as angry as anybody else. Everybody's yeah. got a temper, I'm sure all you have, you know. Sure. But it's just that we, you know, we prefer to make music that is, you know, a bit alive. It's got energy, you know, it's got got a warmth to it. Do you know mm -hmm. what I mean? 
I don't think you'd be getting that with kind of banal stuff, really. It's just ticks boxes, doesn't it? Mm. Probably good for the dance floor in some respects, providing yeah. the production's decent. But yeah. <coughs> prefer to do, yeah, probably, you know, prefer to do something that's real. You know what yeah, I mean? yeah. Well, at the moment, what does um, um, revolt you the, the most? Oh God, anything. Just don't. There's too Anything. Many There's too many Anything. things. Yeah. Too many things. Politics. Anything. You know. Yeah. People's attitudes. Mm -hmm. In politics anything. or? Oh, every, anything. Everywhere. In people. In more. In you know, normal civilians. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Just the way everyone. For instance, everything's been fucked. And everything's fucked. And, you know. People are so divided, and you know, devices have been firmly screwed into people's heads. Mm. The propaganda machine propaganda. is yeah. flying high. Yeah. You know, <laughs> just, you know, people just can't let people be, or, yeah. you know what I mean? Politicians, absolutely useless. Yeah. You name it, I mean, come on, you know, your country's just the same, isn't it? It's that's right, yeah, yeah, that's right, totally the same. Yeah, that's a pity, really. Mm. We believed in France last year or two two years before that. We, we, we got a new president, as yes. probably you uh -huh. know, and uh, we believed that. Um, he, 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 myself, no, but <laughs> a lot of people in France believe that it could be different, but it is not. No, <laughs> some months. That was clear after. almost after about a week of him getting the uh, presidency, wasn't it? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think people were fooled by his youth, weren't they? His, his looks. He wasn't an old footy duddy, was just, he? It's all a fucking pantomime, oh, God, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Whatever country it is, it's just a joke, you know. I think that's it's like it's all tuning in. Every country's tuning into the same story now, yeah. Because there's nowhere else to go in the narrative, you know. So it's, <laughs> the comparisons are there, you know. Donald Trump, and you know they've already made those comparisons between Boris Johnson, yeah. and, yeah. you know. The fact that they were both like on, on TV, you know, 20, 30 years ago, and everyone was hating them both then, mm. and now, you know, and they were both asked back then if they were in interviews whether they'd be prime minister or president, and now they are. It's just like, mm. it's just ridiculous. Yes, it is. <laughs> it is. What about, for instance, the topic of um, ecology? Uh, I've, I've, um, there is nothing, in, I think, in, in, in your songs around ecology. What, what's your position? Ecology. Uh, ecology. Ecology and nature and, and preservation of the oh, environment. Okay, yeah. okay. Sorry for my English. Why? Because I've got a, we've got a carbon footprint as big as we fly everywhere. Mm -hmm. I'm, I'm a meat eater. I eat fish. I contribute on a daily basis All right. to, you know, I'm really conscious of it personally. I'm vegan, and yeah. you know, um, like I watched this documentary about the dairy industry recently and how that's controlling everything. Basically, you know, um, big company needs to go. I hate it. Yeah. Fucking <laughs> oh, Coca-Cola doesn't matter what it is, <laughs> but you never get rid of it. So blah blah blah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um. Could talk about the music industry. I, I know more or less what you think about it, <laughs> but um, is it the, the, the reason why you have uh, recently uh, created your own label to be more independent? Or <coughs> no, not really. It wasn't really. It no. wasn't. It was just. You know, a lot of bands do that. A lot of bands start and do their own label. You know, <laughs> most cool bands do that. So. It was more that really, it was more like just a little tweak, it wasn't, you know, it wasn't an issue with Rough Trade or anything, it was just, you know, it's no, big, it's to do this. no biggie really, do you know what I mean, they were just really supportive and, yeah, yeah, that's, you know what I mean, yeah, yeah, so it was just like, it's, yeah. you know, it's been good, hasn't it, it's good. yeah, it's been good, yeah. it's been a good learning it's curve, it's going to be good as well, we've got, you know, yeah, it's going to be good it's moving happening. forward. Yeah. yeah. All right. Good. <laughs>
What about uh, Binic here, uh, the festival? Did you know the, the festival before? Um, no. 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 You no. never heard about it? No, not at all. Okay. But um, do you have an idea of what Binic is? Um, I do now. Yeah, yeah. we do now. And what, what's I got your the impression tour earlier. What's it's your incredible. Opinion? Just take over the village for the whole time, and all the locals seem to like it. And it's does quite, not it's quite incredible. Yeah, yeah, it's quite unique, it I suppose. It is I suppose not. It's like a difficult for it, for it in a, in a long term sense because the, if it does become more popular, yeah, then it would be a problem. You know. Sure. Yeah. That's a question for uh, for the future, yeah. mm. I think. Yeah. Mm. True.